Okay, this is my guide to M33 firmware 3.52. First thing you want to start off doing is to create your files that you will need. You will need the 1.5 eBoot and the 3.52 eBoot. Rename those eBoots the um the 1.5 you rename 150.pbp and the um 3.521 you re rename 352.pbp it's very important or else you'll brick your PSP or it or I mean the install and the installer will not work if you're running 1.50 you will need the patches which is in this file now if you're on any custom firmware like I am you wanna put your um the creator into the 1.5 only section. I'll drag that here. Just copying. After that's done, go to your ESP, take it out of USB mode, run the game and 1.5 kernel for a custom firmware. And just let that run. It should take around 15 minutes maybe, that's what I've been getting. Maybe a little less, I'm not sure. Okay, now that it's finished the maker, now let's go to there. You'll see this update. Run this. Now, by doing this, you accept the risk of breaking your PSP. I recommend that you use a Pandora battery if you break your PSP. You shouldn't if you follow my steps the right way. This normally takes around 2-3 uh, minutes. More like 2. Okay, it's pretty much done. Now, if it takes a little extra time starting up, don't be worried. It's supposed to be like that. This time it was quick. And 
just check and you should be at the right firmware 3.52 and 3.3 yep yep right there and you have officially got the M33 firmware